What's up guys, back in today with another reaction to Haikyuu 2 the top this time of episode 25, the last episode of the season. Very excited to see what's going to be happening in this episode, it might just be a recap for all I know, but I'm um, really looking forward to it nevertheless. I'm kind of hoping we get a kind of look around at the tournament and see what other games are being played. Uh, maybe a look into Nakoma again as well, um, and how Karasuma are feeling after that big win. Um, again, last uh, last episode was absolutely amazing, definitely check that out if you guys missed it. Um, love the end to the, uh, to, the, uh, to the game, I should say. Um, kind of uh, represents the start of the season very well as well. He and I was just trying so hard, uh, being this ball boy, learning so many things on the sideline, and he brought that into the game and ended up winning us the game with Kageyama. So, um, yeah, I absolutely love the end of the game, and uh, again, it's going to create this new Nakoma versus Karasuno game, which is going to be absolutely nuts next season. Uh, whenever next season is, I'm hoping it's going to be this year, towards the back end of this year, potentially, but again, I've got no real idea. Make sure you let me know what you guys think of this episode, though, down in the comment section. Leave a like on the video if you guys did like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date with any of my reactions. Um, after this series, I will be doing fruit basket daily so if you guys have heard or um, really like that show definitely check in with me with those reactions and let's get right into this episode guys three two one let's go last episode for a while hopefully it won't be too long before the next season as it has already been about a year i think It's perfect. Or so you think. It's forcing that ball over that net, man. Pushing us back, but it's pushing forward. Again, the only two people that could have stopped that. I think that was the only time we actually saw Twins quick stopped as well. But these have had their quick failed a few times, so of course they're they're the ones that know the weaknesses and how to stop it. They've felt that before. Again, it's just kind of poetic that they would be the ones to finally stop that quick and win us the game. Took some good read blocking from the both of them, didn't it? And again, they needed both of them there as well because we see them, both their hands get pushed back a little bit by that ball. So if one of them wasn't there, back to Deuce, we would have gone. Number nine. But yeah, I've got to give it to Narazaki. They've been a sick team. And I think it said they were second seed, so that's one of the favourites out. Surely makes us now one of the favourites. Well, against Nakoma, again, it's very even, so not so sure about that. Do, 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 do. So yeah, definitely have some of my favourite players so far. The Miyagi twins. The real like Aaron as well. Aaron's cool. Um, of course, the substitute Kita. Very interesting character. Very relatable. Not so much for me. Again, I feel like I'm a mix of all of these characters, to be honest. I mentioned in the comment section yesterday. I mean, in general, this show is just so relatable. To a kind of a person who my I was, my main focus in school was kind of sports and such. That's what I went to go on to to do in college and that very stupid decision. Don't really think about any of it. Don't really care at all during those times. But, um, yeah, I was very focused on sports, so almost every episode is relatable. Almost every character's got a little bit to them that I've kind of been through or fought in my life. No matter if they're very reserved or super outgoing. These guys now got to prepare. Face their friends as well, that's the thing. I feel like it's a bit easier sometimes if you don't like the opponents or you don't, don't know them. Yeah, the number 10 is pretty cool as well. 
the uh, the spiker that kind of diagonally moves. And look how hard everyone on this pitch caught tried. Really? You think? I think all you guys gave it your all. Look how knackered everyone looks. Both of you. But at least they can still fight at a time like this. Why well, have we got a zoom in on that? <laughs> wow. Instant regret. Maybe you shouldn't have done it then. But he was watching. Surely he's now improved wrong, right? Yeah, I wouldn't, wouldn't have thought that would be the best idea. Okay, um, he's not his natural enemy. I guess we will see him again in Japan training. If he's still there, not be kicked out now. But well, he did prove himself, to be fair. Are oh, you? Yeah. I have a feeling that might happen as well, you know. Into high. <laughs> is that like another tournament? I'm not quite sure what the Into High tournament is. I've heard of that saying before. But again, I have a feeling, I'm not sure why, I came up with a feeling a couple of episodes ago that um, Atsumu would be one day servant to Hinata, maybe when he's an adult or something. But also knowing that would mean that Kageyama wouldn't be serving to him at that point in time. I wasn't so sure about it, but again, I have a feeling that he will. We'll see Atsumu serving to Hinata on a court one day. That's going to be very powerful. I'm crying. He's right. These guys all deserve an applause, even if they did lose. Their motto is to applaud good plays, right? Yeah, a bit like this. Yeah, it just shows so far, so, just shows how far we've come. In this team, yeah, they're going to improve a lot after this. Sometimes a loss is better than a win, in terms of that journey, as they said before, not the end result. What have you got to apologise for? No, definitely not. Not during a, a all or nothing situation like that. Yeah. Maybe they should have thought about it a little bit more. Exactly, that was a fucking tense game. Two opponents, again, pretty much on the same skill level. They might even be more skillful. But Karasuna end up winning. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Of that process.
Oh, God. <laughs> you really know how to push those buttons, man. Of course, that fucking spiker. Flexible isn't crying. Doesn't seem like the type. Ah. You'll be bragging to your grandchildren about this. That is the type of things you would though, isn't it? These are the type of, again, processes that you do end up talking about later in life. The crazy wing spiker you end up playing with in high school. A very touching moment there. <laughs> it's like everyone's struggling at the minute. You did. Everyone is knackered. Which you love to see. Oh, yeah. Someone else had that moment. Yep. Of course. It's like I'm not going to know skill for Hinata in that department. As he said, it's just going down levels to fall in love even more with the game. Because he's in love with already kind of one aspect of the game. I imagine how many more he's got to learn and master. It's just going to sink him even further. Nice to see Fakuro Danny going through. That makes everyone else's job a bit easier. <clears throat> he did. Nice. But he has to, doesn't he? You've got to think for two people. I thought I fingered she was. Yeah, this one's really up in the air. Oh, is that he not his sister? Potentially. Not sure what she'd be doing. Japan. No, Japan. In Tokyo. And maybe not. Land. Looks like Karasuno getting quite a few fans though. Ah, ah, oh, Sasa Nakoma. God, is it? I mean, I only thought that was Hina's sister because of the orange hair, to be fair. I think her sister was a lot younger. Focus on the losers again. Course. <laughs> a bit embarrassing. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? I never really focused on anything good we do. It did only seem that way. Shows the passion. <laughs> of course. 
Yeah, these camera guys are useless. And it would be absolutely awesome to see yourself play sports on TV like this. It's great that they get the opportunity to. Hey, the receive. <laughs> Yeah, that would have been absolutely awesome for anyone I imagine during their childhood. Happened to me, fortunately not for sports. And yeah, I was a bit of a, a little bit of a delinquent. I won't say too much more though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hundred and thirty. That's optimistic. So we've still got a long way to go actually. We've still got a third round water semi and final. Oh yeah, he's laser focused on winning this. Norovirus. <laughs> what the fuck's a norovirus? I guess that's kind of like a put in for the coronavirus, maybe. Is that an English? So That was a sick line shot. Yeah, Tanaka done really well this episode, didn't he? Well, well I say this episode, this uh, this game. Tsukushima as well, doing the unthankable job. The one no one gets credit for. But has to be done to win the game. Everyone again put a lot of input in, didn't they? us a vital few seconds so now he's saying do it Reach T. Oh God, what are you doing? I don't know if Talica's in here. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh, really? Really? Man, you could have just caught so many people out just then. <laughs> that was definitely framed as that could have been one of the girls' bums or boobs or something, wasn't it? I thought it was Tanika roaming about in the girls' bathroom. But we just get a couple Hinata cheeks. Again, they knew what they were doing there. Yeah. So who's this orange haired girl we saw? So these guys are kind of underdogs going in, hey? They have, to be fair. Shira, Torizawa on the way here and now in Arazaki. Karasuna have beat out some 
top, top class teams, haven't they? These guys have got a tough game on their hands, but these guys aren't bad. Exactly. Any team can win against any team on any given day. And I'm interested to see how Kenma plays. Now he's got Hinata on the other side of the court. I've got a feeling he will in this game. Oh, we got first opening. I think. Oh yeah, of course. This that orange haired girl is always supporting the cover, isn't she? My bad. Oh, Suki, get some sleep. <laughs> I know that face. What was that <laughs> from Tanaka? And yeah, as expected, you know, I just lie and fucking smile and not a creep. <laughs> Yeah, that's their first medium, wasn't it? Wow. Nice little touch. Again, I really think Ken is going to be on probably the best game we'll ever see him play versus Karasuno. Calling that one right now. So who is that orange head girl rated to again? I can't remember. Of course, again, we do see her supporting Nikoma along with um, Liev's sister, don't we? And again, this is a really awesome touch, considering what's going to be happening next season. It's a bit of a shame we didn't hear the uh, the ending for this season. That's probably one of my favourite endings. I kind of wish we heard that during the opening. I right, really sure I see that I'm missing that shot. <laughs> This is during this nationals, isn't it? Now, my favorite part of the song right here. Yeah, really awesome touch to end the season off. Jeez, man. Let's go. This is going to be such a game, isn't it? Look at that smile, man. Fuck it out. That's so sick. Oh, we've still got some time left. Again, I've got a feeling next season is going to be my favourite as well. You get to see the battle at the garbage dump. Yeah. Coaching is hard. <laughs> yeah, it probably is a factor in why he's a good coach. A lot of the best football coaches in the world are kind of not the greatest football players. Thank you for watching.
thank you for bringing us this awesome series. <laughs> And uh, thank you, everyone, for supporting the series so far. Um, again, not quite the end of the series. It is for now, um, which, again, is very much a shame that I won't be watching it every day. As, again, it's been an absolute pleasure. Season on season, getting better and better each season, um, all the way to, again, Shiro Tori's hour, which was my high point of, uh, of all the seasons I watched up until this point. I think that season was absolutely beautiful. This second one, um, this second half of this fourth season has been my second favourite season, that's for sure, as well, with this game against Inarazaki. Um, again, what a, what a way to end this off this season as well. Um, it almost feels like the show's kind of come to an actual close with this ending here but um it wouldn't it wouldn't actually be a bad place to end off the whole show but we're definitely going to see the game versus karasuno and again i've got very very high hopes that that will be uh, my favorite season of all of them so far um again it's just set up to be really hasn't it with us learning so much about the nakoma players and watching them throughout their journey as well such an awesome team uh, as well as karasuno of course who we've been following this whole time so um it's, it's hard to see who you want to win let alone who will win um and, and it's funny that the coma are going in as the kind of underdogs as well which harasuna have always been kind of the underdogs in every game they've played so it's interesting to see those kind of roles reversed um but yeah either way if, if either team goes through i'm, I'm not gonna be mad that's the thing this is a game with the outcome uh, i'm gonna be happy with either way i'm probably gonna be mad at either way as well uh, in a uh, in a certain way that's just again the contradictory kind of guy i am um but yeah it's gonna be uh, gonna be very awesome seeing this match make sure you let me know what you guys thought of this episode though down in the comment section again some beautiful touches in this episode just to end off the season uh leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy the video and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with any of my reactions uh, again a big thank you for all you guys for supporting uh watching commenting liking um and subscribing to the uh, the channel during this series again it's been absolutely brilliant and uh, my first sports anime has been top class so far uh definitely not going to put me off any sports animes that's for sure um definitely going to be watching a few more maybe not uh currently on the channel at the minute but going forward and of course i'm going to be covering part five when that comes out probably late 2022 maybe early 2023 20, uh, so um look forward to that one again thank you guys for all the support and enjoy the rest of your day guys